How's it going, my comic chat army? Long time no review. We've had COVID coming through that. Yeah. And just... It sucked. <laughs> oh, yeah. And everything else in between, losing people at work. Now I'm working 12-hour days. Don't want to really come home and film. But on a happier note, we got lighting. Look at our wall yeah. of greatness, our wall of previously reviewed. That's what yeah. we're going to call it. Yeah. <laughs> This show isn't scripted. It's all coming <laughs> off the top of the dome. Yep, but if there's a book up there that you're curious about, haven't read, want to read, possibly just look for it in our uh, previous videos that we've reviewed and it'll give you a little insight on them. Or wait to the end of the video and click yep. the playlist. Yep. And shout out to 2D Designs for making us custom pop holders that we sold, we sold out of kind of fast. Yeah. Uh, we're going to put a link to them down in the description. You're not gonna be able to get our CCA ones, but they do have other great designs, and check that out. Just kind of our cool way of supporting some small businesses yep. that are on Etsy. Yep. Yep. They supported so. us, we supported them, yep. and it's a father and son business if we need to give you any more reason of why yeah. to go check them out. Yep. But the, uh -huh. re the recount. We've been, we've been... We're a little behind, so and I know. shit show... Um, <laughs> Number two. <laughs> a little and rusty. The recount. Finally. I've been waiting to read. Yep. Yep. Which, this is the second printing that we got because we've got number one up there. Yep. Signed by... Which we met. Yes. We Henry. met Hedrick. And now we need to get Silverbacks to sign that because mm -hmm. I found out that he... Well, it's kind of big news if you're following Hedrick. That Silverbacks is doing movie action movies for every cover. I think they're on like number four now. Yep. And I don't know what part of the series it is, but yeah, enough of my rambling. This is the whole reason you're here. <laughs> oh yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Tell me if y'all like me saying that. It's been, been a while. <laughs> right, y'all know how YouTube works. So I mean, let it's me know. Rusty here, but oh yeah, we got a I got a CCA shirt, one of and one. I'm supporting Mr. August Aguilar with his strange films, yep. as always. But. Can we go first? Yeah. Ah, first? the highly anticipated the, the recount. recount. Well, yeah. So this book, let me just go off and start first off, start saying that it kind of has, you can kind of relate. It gives you a lot of emotions hmm. as you're reading it. So it basically starts off with the speech of from the president who's resigning for a lot of corrupted things that he's doing. So, uh, and it's televised and everything else. Oh, I did not notice that. So it is, the book is in loving memory of, I don't want to ruin that name. I really don't want to, but yep. But anyways, as it's televised and as he's given his resignation. This is fiction, right? You're not, me. this book about, yeah. yeah, you're not trying to persuade anybody's no. political opinion. No. No, okay. definitely not. All right. mm -hmm. Not at all. But and neither is the book, right? Yeah, no, they're not. All right. Um just so, wanted to get that out there. Yeah, I think that well, I'll touch on that in a minute. So, anyways, he's assassinated. Public televised assassination of this president as he's giving this crazy speech. But yeah, so anyways, he's as he's assassinated he's assassinated by a CIA agent who, you know, that's crazy enough. <laughs> the vice president, which is a female, ends up being immediately sworn into office and it's kind of like all hell breaks loose. The group that is a part of this and involved in this is called the Masses. They wind up taking over the television because, and just basically- Kind of like anonymous. It's, yes, it's kind of like a V for Vendetta kind of vibe meets a lot of these other, you know, crazy, old presidential movies and shows and things like that you know you've got stuff like american horror story that did the elect and uh, you know um. any all this kind of stuff but anyways they're basically it's kind of like they're turning it's like they're trying to turn people against each other it's like the, we're out we're gonna get everybody that funded this um president that supported him that voted like anybody that had any involvement it's kind of real world events exactly that's what i'm saying it kind of hits you as you're reading this nice timing so basically at the you're left with this big 
like question of what's going to happen with the vice president and her secret service agent who is a female also. So it's just, it's a good, it, they ended it really good. It really leaves you grasping for more. I'm a huge Hedrick fan as always. <laughs> like I read all of his books. I not saying that like I would, if I didn't like this book, I would tell you but it's a fantastic book and I can see why there's so much talk and rave and everybody wanting this book. So good job as always, Hedrick. Oh yeah, I mean, this is way different than anything else we've read from him. Yeah, and I didn't want to give too much. It's kind of hard to give too much, but I wanted to give enough to where I just, I definitely recommend it. I'm just, you guys can need to read it. You do, but. Anyways. Shit show number two. <laughs> This book you've been doing reading for well, a while. You know, I which... was yeah, I wasn't honestly I wasn't expecting this book to take the turn that it did. I thought it was gonna be a fun, campy, kind of superhero y adventure book that yeah, you, the superheroes are down on their luck, but they're gonna come and rise to fame again. That type of story. Did not think it was gonna be like this, and it took a wild left turn. <laughs> And the demon from the first one, I fucking don't remember his name, <laughs> come back and kidnaps Mr. Mr. McCoy's kids. Oh, this book is nuts. Like, definitely if you haven't bought um, Shit Show, you need to because this book is insane. First one's awesome. This one's awesome. I think it's only three parts. I'm kind of sad. I wish it was six. <laughs> just because just to see how it's going to end. But the demon kidnaps his kids and Mr. McCoy basically basically is getting everything taken from him from being the way he was kind of, it was in, in not so many words, being a, uh, basically a drunk. <laughs> Seriously. Like, his kids is kidnapped. Half of the team is gone. Now someone's going to make a big sacrifice to, to save the day. Oh, I'm gonna show you all the third. The artwork's always really good in these books too. Oh yeah, I'm gonna show you all the third cover, but definitely pick it up. I was not, that's number three, was not expecting it to go this way at all. Great job, Adam. That's the, mm -hmm. and we interviewed Adam. Yes. And he said that his favorite page in his book was the last page. And I, I see why. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna show it to you because it's gonna ruin the book. But pick up Shit Show. Number two. I mean, the, his art and the colors that they use oh, yeah, in right. his books are so just, they're so yeah. beautiful. I think that it's just, they're so beautiful. I'll show you a couple pages. And every page, like every panel, everything, every page seems to have a different. And they pop. Yes. Yeah. Like if you've seen this on your, a hey, what movie reference? <laughs> Come on guys. Mike Wazowski. Yep. <laughs> Trying not to, yeah. but pick up shit show too. I think we're the first people on YouTube to review it. You know, I want to say before we finish, we we do we do review a lot of Scout books. We've that's pretty much what we started with reviewing was Scout, but Scout puts out some banging books. Like their yes. artists, their creators, everybody that they work with are amazing. You can't help but want to follow and review the books that they put out like they whoever's behind picking everything they know what they're doing and they just continue to keep killing it with everything and i know that they have some amazing things probably in the works and oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah i mean they're just awesome we love to review their stuff oh yeah and we do. trying to get rich boy interviewed that's kind of com complicated but coming and I'm still working on, what's his name, James? Um, I forget his last name, but James, yep. the, the CEO of Scout. Yep. That's right here. The CEO. I don't know how to say it. James Hickey. Yeah. Trying to get James Hickey to, to interview so we can clarify some of these books and what he's got coming too. Yep. So we got big things coming. And subscribe yep. because all this month we got a bunch of cool creators coming. Yeah. 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 Is there anything you want to tell the people before we go? No. That's about it. Just please support us. Sorry for the long wait. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting there. Yeah. All right. Peace.